Welcome back, the Collector's Collection. This time around, I would like to talk about a fragrance that gets a lot of bad rap. I don't understand why. Um, Aventus or Creed Aventus. I think it's absolutely awesome. I also believe that it belongs in every gentleman's uh, fragrance cupboard. That was one thing that was said to me. So very early on, when I started to uh, discover the, the niche fragrance world, I went to a, a particular retailer. Uh, she has been there for forever, I think. Um, well, Noah came out of the art, blah, 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 and he bought some fragrance from, from that area. Um, and she said to me, because I was debating, do I buy it, not buy it? I was getting all, the, I was reading, seeing all these reviews, and there, some people go, oh no, you shouldn't waste your money on that. And, you know, it's you can get copycat versions of it, blah blah blah. And um, I, because of course, you know, it would be nice to have a wheelbarrow full of money so that you can uh, get all the niche fragrances that you want. And so I said to her, you know, uh, Aventus Creed, uh, this one, that, blah 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 blah. And and she said to me, very sort of like, you know. Offhand, she goes, every gentleman needs to have Aventus Creed in their cupboard. Now, regarding the other ones, so that was it. So she just said, look, you need to buy Aventus Creed, you need it. You, you need to own it. It's, it needs to be part of your, your um, and she called it a fragrance cupboard. I had a mental picture of this enormous thing. And this was early on, and I thought, you gotta be kidding me. I mean, I only need three or four. <laughs> I find that this fragrance is, I, I haven't smelled anything like it. I know, and I know that there, I know, you're gonna go, oh, but such and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, yeah, sure. I have smelled things kind of like it, but for me, this fragrance is, is ultra unique. Um, this is, this is really, this is a sexy, uh, this is a really sexy fragrance. Uh, I, I, I look just like I was told. It needs it. You need to have it. It needs to be part of your fragrance cupboard. What I love about it is the opening on this fragrance is it. It, it really brings you in very quickly. There's a wonderful fruity accords in there, and there's a whole collection of amazing uh, fruit notes. Um, apple, black currant. I know pineapple is a big deal. It plays a really strong part in this. What I also love is that, so it starts off very fresh and it just draws you in nicely. Uh, it, then in the heart note, it has a lot of flowers and you would think that with all those flowers in the middle, you think it might just get a little bit too soft. But in actual fact, it, it just gives it another, another layer. I know there's rose in there and I know actually rose in, in male fragrances is beautiful. Um, finally, it settles into the more, I guess, um, stronger notes. So things like musk, uh, I know ambergris is in there, um, oak moss. For me, I love oak moss. Sometimes I find that oak moss can be a little bit strong. In this case here, the, the whole fragrance plays beautifully together. It stays as a very, a very fresh, it is considered as a aromatic fougere, so that automatically tells you that aromatic, that sort of fresh sort of fragrance, uh, it stays throughout the whole throughout the whole um, life of the, the actual perfume. The other thing that actually I find, so okay, so it is an expensive purchase. So to go out there, uh, you do need to be committed to the, to the perfume. Um, you, you, I guess you do need to love it. Would you blind buy it? I, I'm gonna say you can. Um, I would be surprised if you walk away going, that was the worst thing ever for that price. Um, I think it's a, I think it's a, it's a good investment in the sense that it will last you a long time. I also find that if I spray only two sprays, it lasts for a very long time. For me, at least six to eight hours comfortably. I also find that the silage on this is phenomenal. It, it really projects beautifully. Every time, and I'm not, this is no exaggeration, every time I wear this fragrance, People are aware. Um, I could be, uh, I've had some situations where I'm walking ahead of someone who's behind me and they're like, yo, I, I like your fragrance, nice nice perfume. Um, other times I'm just talking to somebody else and, all, and they, in mid conversation, they interrupt and they go, what are you wearing? That, that, that smells amazing, that's actually a really good. I mean, I even had one, and I wore this the other day, um, I stepped out of the car, started talking, we were mid conversation and all of a sudden, because I know I'm into fragrances, like, whoa, what are you wearing today? That really smells awesome. So honestly, for me, I don't get 
the, the bad rap that this fragrance gets. Uh, it's an awesome fragrance. The longevity is, is very strong. The silage on it is phenomenal. You'll get good bang for your buck. I would strongly recommend it. And like it was said to me very early on in my niche journey, you need to get it. You need to be, it needs to be part of your fragrance cupboard. Agree or disagree? Uh, I've got a feeling a lot of people are gonna say different things, but that's cool. You know what? Fragrance is a very personal thing. Um, obviously perfume you buy for yourself. What do you like? Um, but you also buy for others in the sense that if you are going into a meeting uh, or you're going into a situation, a date, first date or whatever it may be, you're gonna put on a fragrance to try to impress someone else. And I'm gonna to say to you, this is the one that will create the, a really good impression. Thanks everyone, that's it for this one here. Subscribe, would love you to join the Niche Fragrance Collector family. Let me know your thoughts in regards to fragrances that you're enjoying. Uh, I would love to, you know, tell me something new, different. Uh, are there others in the Creed family that, you are, that you're enjoying? I'd love to go and, and test it out for myself too. Until next time, thanks everyone. I love you.